I'm AJ Marty from Phoenix Tattoo Studio. Um, I am the owner operator of the studio. I've been an artist for my entire life and when I got into the tattooing I just fell in love with how you can have a piece of art with you at all times and it's like something you can take with you forever. I actually started in high school. All of my uh, friends were like, oh, will you draw me a tattoo? Or will you draw this for me? Or will you draw that? And so that's when I started to get into looking, like researching about it and how to do it and this kind of thing. And that's kind of where it started from. Line here mm -hmm. and just do the shading all the way down. Fill it in. There you go. Just want to do that? All right. So now that I get to do it for a living, it's so fun to actually be able to do art every day, have a blast at work, see people that I hang out with, and just, it's a total, like, a family thing in there. It's just a lot of fun to do it all day, every day. The biggest dream that I have with tattooing is to be able to be known for my art more than just in the, my community. Um, like, in the future, I really want to have, you know, I'd love to have a chain of phoenixes around the country or the world or whatever. But I really want to do is learn to, to do as much tattooing different aspects as I can. Like, whether it be in, you know, portraits or the realism part of it or the new, you know, the new UV color, the ink that isn't like black lighting. Anything that I can learn that's not the normal. I'm really, really into, and I, I would love to be as big as I could be, but my main goal is to make sure that my clients are happy, so whether I'm just a small town girl from Galesburg that does tattoos or world renowned, it doesn't matter as long as everybody's, you know, happy when they leave. That's, that's my number one goal, I would say. It's still seen from the masses that it is a delinquent type of thing. Come on, I'll go. Yeah, that's awesome. That's, that's it. Like, you are a not-so-great person if you have a tattoo. Because I look at them as it's an art form, and it would be like someone going to an art gallery and buying a painting and coming to get a tattoo here. Does it suck? Yeah, a little bit. It sucks? Yeah. Just stay right there. You're doing great. Get the heart done right now. <laughs> at last count, I think I have 15. But, uh... I have a couple that I've had different sessions and stuff, so it's kind of, I think I've sat down in a tattoo chair probably about 25 times, but, and it's a, it's an awesome experience, so it's a cool feeling too, so. My tattoos are extremely meaningful. Every single one that I have is kind of like a bookmark of my life. Every one that I see, I can say, you know, I was doing that at this time, or, or I was doing this at this time, and I had, I had that going on at this time. And, I love that every single one of them are my art. I've drawn every one of them. So, I mean, if I, God forbid, if I ever have anything that happens to me and I can't use my hands, I am i can't do anything. So I know that I'll have my art with me at all times until I die. 